super quick coming on I am in the middle of going to paint my box and I am going to use my Inca Gold to paint it okay yes it's a rubbing buff yes that's what it's made for is it the only thing you can do with it no so I am going to show you how I use my Inca Gold to paint right so I'm taking a plastic paintbrush with plastic edge at the end of it and it's angled okay I'm going to take a scoop of some of my paint now this is when quite clumpy because the other day I had to moisturize it I just added some water and glycerin and it makes it work fine again okay so I'm adding a wee dollop of paint into one of my palettes okay and I'm scraping off all the paint so it's not getting wasted okay and what I can't get off in the palette I'm going back into my tub with there we go and then just wipe it off on it a bit of tissue paper okay and you're fine put my paintbrush back put the lid on my Inca Gold and this colour is rose alright oops I have got some water in my distress sprayer so I'm just adding a wee bit into my palette alright so it's quite moist in there press that there actually oh everything's fallen on top of me tonight then I'm going to get my paintbrush again and just give it a wee mush around and just try and liquefy it properly okay and it should be quite a thick paint okay you can then liquid it down further if you wish I won't be I will be just using it as it is because I want it to have quite a strong pigment to it obviously the more water you add to it the less pigmented it becomes but that's it mixed up okay so I'm just going to clean out my brush over here it's cleaned up properly says. and just so I don't waste anything I'm going to clean the brush off I clean the end of my brush off with my new brush and I'll just dip that in water the now okay and then you're just painting it on now as I said it's quite thick so just work at it a wee bit But you will see a little goes a long long way okay and as I said just work with it any of the dry clumps dip it back in your water and just pull it over to the side to liquefy it again and then you can go back in Okay. and you can see how well that's covering well you can I'll show you it in a minute I'll lift you up so you can see it while I'm doing it it would have been good to have seen it from the beginning but you'll see there how well that's covering and you're just going in and 
and as I said if there's any wee clumps on your brush like that wee bit there take it back to your palette dip it in rub it on the side and then go back okay and it just covers beautifully and as I said you can rub those um, lumps out because they are just pigment they're just colour nothing more and honestly a little goes a long long way with this stuff that's why I chose this because the pigment's so strong um, and I knew it would colour it and cover very very well so you can see here where the white is and I'll just show you how well it covers so you're just going on with your paint and as I said just give it a good few runs over and then just drag your brush back through it now there is a few wee bits of clumpy bits on that what I would do I'll just sit that there a wee minute is just get a bit of fancy material that I call toilet roll you could use a dry baby wipe you could use a um, kitchen roll, any sort of paper, napkin, whatever. Oops, I missed a bit up there actually, so I'll fix that first. There we go. And then all you're doing is just gently buff over the top of it. And you'll see it comes up nice and smooth. Okay. And remember, this is going to be covered. This is the bottom. So there's going to be a lid on this most of the time anyway. But I like things to be done completely. So that's why I'm making sure that it's all covered. But you don't have to. If you're not bothered with it, don't do it. Um, but if it does bother you, feel free and as I said, look at the other side. You can see it on that angle there, how well it covers. It's just perfect. So, think outside and remember, use your products differently. They're not always just what they say on the tin, okay? Thanks for watching, speak to you soon, bye for now.